Hi, my name is Bahadur Ahmedov. In this video, we are going to solve a problem, the typical problem which you might have in the calculus exam. Essentially, finding a tangent line, the equation of a tangent line to the curve at some point. So let's first of all discuss our strategy. So the strategy would be like this. So let's say you are given some curve on the rectangular coordinate. So it's going to be x line and y line. And the, the equation of this curve is also given as the y is equal to the f of x. So what you need to do is you need to figure out, let's say, the equation of a tangent line at this point x0. So please note, if this point is given as a x0, then the coordinates of this point is going to be x0 and f of x0. So what we need to do is we need to find the line which is just touching this curve at this point. And as any other line in the world, the tangent line is also going to have the typical equation in the form of y is equal to the kx plus b, where the k is going to be the slope and b is going to be the y-intercept. So the problem is we are just given one point and we can find one of the parameters just using the coordinates of this point. And we are going to find the slope of this line by just taking the derivative of this curve at this point. So the slope of this line is going to be equal to, so uh, the slope of this line is going to be equal to the derivative of this curve at this point. And, and then we are going to substitute the coordinates of this point into this line because this point is on this line as well. So it's going to be the, the we can find a beam. So the b is in this case is going to be y0 minus kx0. So we know what is the k, we know what is the y0. y0 is going to be f of x0, right? So minus k is f prime of x0 times the x0. So this is how we are going to find the b. So that's our strategy. So we are given the curve y is equal to the tx times the e in the power of x. And we are given the point even the coordinates of these points are simply 0 and 0. We just need to plug in everything to here and find the equation of the tangent line. So let's do that. So the function is given as f of x is given to x times the e in the power of x. So first of all, we need to find the derivative of this function. And you see, so we are going to find the derivative of this function using so-called the product rule or the multiplication rule, right? So let's denote this function as the g, and let's denote this function as the h. Then it's going to be 2 times the g times the h, uh, the derivative of this function. And this is going to be equal to 2 times the g prime h plus g h prime. So I'm just going to plug in everything to here. So what's the derivative of the g? If the g is equal to the x, it's going to be simply 1 times the h is e in the part of x plus g is x times the derivative of the h, which is going to be again e in the part of x. So we can take out the e in the part of x out of the brackets, and what is left is going to be simply 1 plus x. So what, in, what we need to do is we need to evaluate the derivative at the point x0, right? So again, so the point is given as the 0 and 0. So essentially, our point x0, f of x0 or x0 and y0 is given as a 0 and 0. So we need to value the derivative of this curve at the point x0, which is equal to the 0. So I'm just going to plug in 0 to here and to here, to all of the appearances of the x. So it's going to be 2 times the e in the part of 0 times the 1 plus 0, which is going to be equal to the 2 simply. So the slope of the tangent line to this curve at this point is equal to the 2. So now the second part is to find a b. So now we know the equation of the tangent line should be as 2x plus b, and we have to find a b. At the same time, we know that the point 0, 0 is lying on the curve, but at the same time, it's lying on this tangent line as well. So if you substitute 0 and 0, it should be fulfilled. So let's substitute this. It's going to be 0 is equal to the 2 times to the 0 plus b, and it's clear that the b is equal to the 0. From here. So we've got the equation of a tangent line which is equal to the 2x simply. So now let's try to draw sketch the curves of all of these functions. So using so-called the application GeoGebra we can try to do that. Um, 
So we first of all are going to draw the sketch the graph of the first functions of the curve to x times the e in the part of x. So that's going to be this curve. And at the same time, we can sketch the curve of the tangent line, so which is going to be tx. Okay. So you see, so uh, this is going to be the tangent line at this point x0, which is just touching that. So essentially, we are going to solve all of these problems in this kind of way. So thank you very much for your attention. I hope that this video was helpful for you.